Kathleen Erin Walsh is an American actress and businesswoman. She is best known for her role as Dr. Addison Montgomery on the ABC television dramas Grey's Anatomy and Private Practice. She is also known for her roles as Rebecca Wright on the short-lived NBC sitcom Bad Judge, Olivia Baker on 13 Reasons Why, and The Handler on The Umbrella Academy. Chapter 1, Early Life Walsh was born in San Jose, California, the daughter of Angela and Joseph Patrick Walsh, senior she grew up in a Catholic household in Tucson, Arizona. Her mother is of Italian descent, and her father was Irish, from Navan in County Meath. Walsh graduated from Catalina Magnet High School and studied acting at the University of Arizona before dropping out. Walsh moved to New York City and joined a comedy troupe, Burn Manhattan, supporting herself by waitressing. Chapter 2, Career? Before modeling, Walsh worked at Burger King and Dairy Queen. She began as a model in Japan in the 1980s where she also taught English. Later, she moved to Chicago and worked with the Piven Theater Workshop. She performed on national public radio in the production of the radio play Born Guilty. Chapter 2 Section 1 Television Roles After playing Kathy Buxton in The Homicide, Life on the Street episode Stakeout in 1996 and Navy Lieutenant Kirsten Blair in the Law and Order episode Navy Blues, Walsh's first major television appearance was in 1997, when she appeared on The Drew Carey Show as Drew Carey's love interest, Nikki Pfeiffer. She wore a fat suit in some episodes of the show, as the Nikki character was a formerly obese woman who lost weight and slowly started to gain it back. Walsh went on to portray Carol Nelson in HBO's The Mind of the Married Man television series, and played Norm MacDonald's romantic interest in the sitcom The Norm Show. She made a guest appearance on CSI, crime scene investigation as Mimosa, a transgender woman. She sometimes appeared in sketches on Late Night with Conan O'Brien. Walsh had a recurring role on Karen Sisko as Detective Marley Novak in 2003 and 2004. In 2005, she was cast in her breakout role in the ABC series Grey's Anatomy, as Dr. Addison Montgomery, the estranged spouse of Derek Shepard. In February 2007, Walsh's Grey's Anatomy character received a spin-off of Grey's Anatomy that began airing in September 2007. Tay Diggs, Tim Daly, Amy Brenneman, Chris Lowell, and Audra McDonald were cast in the spin-off, Private Practice. Walsh would return for six episodes across the fourth through eighth seasons of Grey's Anatomy, including the musical episode Song Beneath the Song. Beginning in September 2007, Walsh has appeared in television commercials for the 2008 Cadillac CTS. She is also the current spokeswoman for Caress Exotic Oil Infusions Body Wash. On June 12, 2012, Walsh announced that the sixth season of Private Practice would be her final season. However, she mentioned she'd be open to reprise her role in Grey's Anatomy for a few guest spots. In 2013, Walsh appeared in Full Circle, a 10-episode ensemble drama series created by Neil LeBute, and airing on DirecTV's audience network channel. In 2014, Walsh had a supporting role in the first season of FX's television series Fargo. She had a guest starring role in Hulu's original series The Hot Wives of Orlando and later starred in the NBC series Bad Judge, which aired for one season. As of 2017, Walsh stars in the Netflix drama series 13 Reasons Why, as the mother of a child who commits suicide. Her performance was met with critical acclaim, having been dubbed the best work of her career. In 2019 and 2020, Walsh had a significant recurring role as the handler in the Netflix series The Umbrella Academy. Her most recent role has been on Netflix original, Emily in Paris, where she plays Emily's boss who gets pregnant and can no longer move to Paris for their marketing job, so she sends Emily instead. Chapter 2 Section 2 Film Roles in 1995, Walsh starred in her first film. Normal Life, a crime drama, was her film debut, she played the sister of a bank robber played by Luke Perry. In Peppermills, 
she portrayed a kleptomaniac. Walsh appeared in the cult film Henry, Portrait of a Serial Killer, Part 2. She gained attention in a major Hollywood production as Will Ferrell's character's wife in the family comedy, Kicking and Screaming. Walsh has appeared in several other films with Ferrell, including Bewitched and In Wake Up, Ron Burgundy, The Lost Movie, an alternate film to Anchorman. In 2003, Walsh appeared in Under the Tuscan Sun. Regarding her lesbian roles, Walsh said, Do I give off a girl-on-girl -girl vibe, I wonder? Or is it because I'm tall? I guess the chicks just dig me. Walsh was set to star opposite in the supernatural thriller 1408, but had to drop out due to scheduling conflicts. Walsh starred in the biblical horror film Legion, that was released on January 22, 2010. She played Charlie's mother in The Perks of Being a Wallflower. Chapter 2 Section 3, Theatre In May 2010, Walsh made her off-Broadway debut opposite Paul Sparks in Atlantic Theatre Company's world premiere of Stephen Belber's Dusk Rings a Bell. The new play began previews on May 19 and opened May 27 at Atlantic Stage 2 and played through June 26. The New York Times called it a sublime, beautifully acted drama. She also had a long theatre career in Chicago, which included roles in Happy Birthday Wanda June, The Danube, Moon Under Miami and Troilus and Cressida. In New York, Walsh was a member of the improvisational comedy troupe, Burn Manhattan, and the New York City Players Theatre Ensemble. Chapter 2 Section 4, Fashion Walsh founded Boyfriend LLC, a beauty and lifestyle company, in 2010. The company launched its first product in November 2010, a perfume called Boyfriend. HSN, a leading multi-channel retailer, and Walsh partnered to launch the Boyfriend fragrance with live appearances by the actress-slash-entrepreneur on HSN, November 11th and 12th. Walsh's fragrance train case, including Boyfriend Eau de Perfume, Pulse Point Oil and Votive Candles, sold out on day one exceeding sales expectations. Leading up to the launch of Boyfriend, Walsh wrote, and directed eight web commercials, relaying the sentiments the Boyfriend scent was developed to evoke. Launched via various social media channels, including Twitter, YouTube and select blogs, the Boyfriend web immersions have been viewed more than 200,000 times to date and were released by Walsh prior to her appearance on HSN, to drive excitement and anticipation. Chapter 3, Personal Life In April 2007, Walsh began dating 20th Century Fox executive Alex Young. Young proposed to Walsh during a trip to San Francisco, California. They married on September 1, 2007 at the Ojai Presbyterian Church in Ojai, California. On December 11, 2008, Young filed for divorce, citing irreconcilable differences, the official date of separation in the divorce petition was listed as November 22. On December 24, 2008, Walsh counterfiled for divorce, contesting the date of separation listed in Young's divorce papers. The divorce was finalized on February 5, 2010. Chapter 3 Section 1, Health In September 2017, Walsh revealed that she was diagnosed with a benign meningioma in 2015. She underwent surgery and had the tumor successfully removed. Walsh took a nine-month break to recover. Walsh underwent a hip replacement in November 2019. Chapter 4, Social and Political Activism Since the summer of 2007, Walsh has been the spokesperson for Narcolepsy Network, working to promote national awareness of narcolepsy through infomercials and DVDs. In January 2008, Walsh participated in a video for Democratic presidential candidate Barack Obama called Yes We Can, produced by Will I Am of the Black Eyed Peas. She also campaigned for Obama in Arizona, Texas, Nevada, and Pennsylvania. In July 2008, Walsh was nominated as a candidate on the Unite for Strength slate for a place on the National Governing Board of the Screen Actors Guild in elections scheduled for September 18, 2008. 
On September 18, 2008, Walsh was elected to serve on the SAG board for a three-year term. Walsh supports pet adoption and frequently campaigns for the cause. On February 7, 2008, she cut the ribbon to a new dog adoption center in Times Square. In 2005, Walsh joined the Planned Parenthood Federation of America's Board of Advocates, and in 2008 received the PPFA Maggie Award for an artist who stands up for reproductive health and freedom. She has participated in numerous Planned Parenthood activities, including national fundraisers, local Planned Parenthood affiliate events, the PPFA Awards Gala, and Lobby Day on Capitol Hill promoting the need for comprehensive sex education. In January 2009, she spoke at the Planned Parenthood Presidential Inauguration Brunch in Washington, D.C. As announced in late 2009, Walsh partnered with Ocean Conservancy and advocacy group Oceana to call for increased sea turtle protections. She joined experts from the group on a trip to the Virgin Islands to witness the turtles hatching and moving to the sea. During the 2016 election, Walsh was a supporter of Hillary Clinton publicly endorsing her and campaigning for her several times in California, Arizona, New Hampshire, and Virginia. Chapter 5, Filmography Chapter 5 Section 1, Film Chapter 5 Section 2, Television Chapter 5 Section 3, Video Games